What's up, YouTube? My name is Genius, bringing you guys part four for my playthrough on Pokemon Sword. Before this video ever starts, support the channel by scrolling down a little bit, smashing that like button, and clicking that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. So, guys, in the last episode, we actually completed the first gym, which was the grass gym right here. Now, we're going to be moving on to the second gym. We actually might get into the second gym in this video, but first off, we have to get backtrack a little bit to route four actually haven't did this haven't captured the pokemon within here right here but we got these diglets and all this we got like this hate area over here which is actually very cool and i'm actually pretty fond of it let's check out what we have i know we got some trainers first and all that like look at this we have this pokemon there <gasps> it's an electric i want him but we're gonna battle this trainer first get him out the way then catch him we're gonna be completing this route doing the trainers catching all the pokemon here then we're gonna be moving on getting a new pokemon through our team which i'm hyped for Collect them more and head towards this uh, second gym town, which is going to be awesome. <gasps> what is this? Galarian Meow? Look at him. <laughs> he looks like a, like a where the wild things kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> He's hilarious, but we're going to give him with this nice little pluck. If he has a berry on him, dude, it's ours. Like, give it up already. <laughs> Let's go. B -b -b See you later, punk. Let's get him. Let's get him. Meow. <laughs> Well, 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 well. Let's fight him up. Let's give him this pluck again. The pluck didn't do too much damage. Was that not very effective? Yeah, wait a minute. What is he? What type is he? I don't even know what type he is. Is he part like rock or something? We're going to power trip him up, hit him with the start. Just probably not very effective either. No, it does, but it doesn't do as much damage. Yeah, it's fine. We're chilling. We're just crushing it right now. <laughs> Uh, let's keep let's keep whooping on him hit him with this pluck again but yeah dude i saw that electric in this field right here i'm gonna catch him up get him on all that we need one more pluck and then we'll be chilling oh no he keeps growling us that's why we keep doing less damage jesus meow you hunk of junk you hunk of junk hopefully this can take him out will it come on corpus squire come on buddy take him out oh if he growls at us again okay he's gonna scratch us we can take him out with our next hit which is fine oh we crit it hunk of junk dude what a hunk of junk Okay, let's hit him up here. Get him with that Pluxy. Yay. My face, old boy. He is dead. Is that his only Pokemon? Is, if it's not, we're going to have to switch out because Corvus Squire's attack is down. But there you go. We get that level up for him. Any moves you want to learn? Let's go. C Dot. I actually want to keep him out. We're going to actually keep him out. Even though his attack's down, I think this super effective will actually make up for it. Maybe we can still one hit him up. Let's see. Let's get him with this Pluck once again. Come on. Finish him off. Nah, our attack's down. Our attack's down a good amount. He's just gonna tackle us up, hit us up a little bit. Give us a quick rip skis. Uh, let's finish him off here, though. We'll get this quick pluck. But, dude, guys, I've been playing this game like crazy, dude. I've been all in this game, dude. It's so much fun, dude. I'm thinking it might be the best Pokemon game ever to come out. Like, dude, so far, it is phenomenal. But I'm not gonna judge it until I completely beat this game and get all the Pokemon and all that good stuff. But hey, who's gonna send out another Butterfree? We're gonna keep Corvus Squire out. We're gonna hang on to Corvus Squire here. And keep ripping. But yeah, dude, I'm absolutely in love with this game. It's phenomenal. Everything about it, the detail that they put in there, the wild areas. Just so far, it's just been phenomenal. Oh, we'll only take him down. Not even a half health. Ooh, don't confuse me. Don't make this battle longer than it has to. You're going to lose either way. <laughs> He's going to lose either way. Like, what's the point of uh, making it go longer? But there we go. Rip him up. Oh, did we crit? Well, how come that one did more damage? I don't know. But it's fine. We're chilling. There we go. It should be the end of level. Oh, we're ending the battle. Dude, that XP was bumping right there. Let's get it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's explore this route more. And there's got to be a good amount of Pokemon that we catch. I saw this Electric over here. Let's go catch him up real quick. He's just chilling. I want him so bad. Dude, look at him. <laughs> Yo, he was the Electric type in Pokemon uh, Emerald. Well, Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald Gen 3. He was that Electric type that everybody had. He was on everyone's team. He's dope. Let's hit him with this Pluck. Try to bring him down. Got him down the yellow. We're going to throw this Pokeball out right here. Come on. Get the boy. Get the boy. Come on. We got this. Womp him. Womp him. Oh, pff. critical catch, dog. We got a critical catch. That was my first one. So critical catch is when it doesn't shake three times. It just shakes once. And then, boom, catches them right away, which is awesome, dude. I love getting critical catches. There we go. Caught that electric right here. We're just going to move on. What is that? It's a glaring Meowth. Come here. <laughs> We're going to snag this boy up, too. He looks so cool. <laughs> I'm hoping I can actually evolve my Trudel in today's video, too, because he evolves to level 22. So, four more levels that we should be getting there. So, hopefully, we can get a Dreadnought in today's video, and we're going to be catching or getting another Pokemon in our team. You guys will see him later. All right, let's keep moving along here. We got Electrux chilling here. We got this. What is that? You see that little... What's this thing? What is that? Oh, it's a Pikachu. 
It's a Pikachu there, but we hit a random encounter. Oh, what is this thing? This is a cutie fly, dude. Let's catch this thing. Yeah, we don't need the Pikachu. So you can catch Pikachu. That answers my question from um, a while ago. In episode one, I believe, was it? No, episode two, when you can either get the Pikachu or Eevee, depending on what game you had. So that answers my question. You can catch Pikachu and Eevee. Oh, we need some bug types in here. We need some bug types, yo. But we're actually gonna be making our way towards the second gym, which is a water gym. So do we have oh, our thwack? He's just gonna own it there. But we catch this cutie fly, we can get moving on, collect more Pokemon, and battle the trainers here. Alright, there's Pikachu. Look at this boy. Look at Pikachu right here. What is that? You see this thing? What is that thing? I want it. No, Electric told me I got the Electric ran after me. This hunk of junk ran after me. I want to get that other Pokemon. I think it was a pumpkin boo? Was that what it was? Oh, yeah, dude. This is what I wanted. It is a pumpkin boo. These things are awesome. What are they? They're ghosts and grass, I believe. Woo. Dude, this is what I wanted. We got that. That thing got in the way. The electric ran over. Did you? Oh, you kidding me? It confused us. Now we're confused and paralyzed. But the electric ran over in front of our path and blocked off when we were trying to get the pumpkin boo. Come on. This is going to be our first pumpkin Pokemon. <laughs> We need pumpkins. Oh, it popped out right away. That was our first Pokemon to actually pop out. Jeez. I think it popped out right away. Not even a shake. We're going to go for another throw here. Come on, get in here. Get in here, boy. We need our pumpkins. One, two, three. All right, dude. Why did the first one give us such a hard time? <laughs> Not even a shake for us. <laughs> but awesome, dude. We get the pumpkin. Grab this Pokeball. What we got here? A cleanse tag. Okay. Any other Pokemans? We got the electric there. Do I see anything else? I see this little random area. We're going to check it out. See if we got a new Pokemon here. <gasps> oh, it's a Wooloo. I thought it was like the big cotton Pokemon. <laughs> I wish you had take it out for its XP. Oh, we got this trainer right here. I'm going to battle this trainer up. Get some XP for my Tootle dude. Like I said, we need to get him to level 22. But I think we kind of caught most of the Pokemon here. We got the electric. We got the pumpkin boo. There. We already have a Pikachu. That's the thing. So we're going to be chilling. We actually have to switch out, dude. This Pikachu will probably eat our Toodle up. It's electric. It's just going to murk on it. Um, let's go to our, uh, let's go to our Thwacky. Wow, our Corvus Squire and our Toodle is actually paralyzed right now. So we got to go take him to the Pokemon Center before we actually head over. I'm just trying to catch the Pokies, man. Just trying to p catch the Pokies. Going to hit us with this quick attack. Dude. Nothing, dude. All right, let's hit him with this double hit. Double hit does work. Actually, I shouldn't have. He might have static on him. That's what I'm thinking. It's going to paralyze. See? Like I said, dude, I'm dumb. Should have thought before, and now I can't move. Get the second hit. Oh, no, we could move. That's fine. But still, I knew it was coming. Now we had our whole squad is actually paralyzed. <laughs> Let's go hit this double hit. One more time. We just need to get it. Oh, Electro Ball, dude. That, ooh. Dude, I love the way the moves look in this game, too. They just look phenomenal. Like, every single thing. Oh, no. We're really paralyzed. He's going to get another, like, quick attack off or something. Another Electro Ball. Coming at us. Going to deal a little bit more damage. We gotta go heal these boys up for real. What you mean we're still paralyzed? Jesus. They'll give us a quick attack. Just murking on us right now. Double hit. Thank you. There we go. Finish off this Pikachu. Hopefully that's the last one so we can go heal up our Pokemon. Let's see. Come on. Is that the, his only pokes? Is that his only Pokemon? Oh, nice levels. Chew to level 19. That is, that is his only Pokemon. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, I healed my Pokemon up. I got him out of there. What is that? That's the glaring Meowth. We don't really want him. We got Electric Pump Caboos. Oh, TM. We got to go get that TM for real. There's a TM over here. Let's see if we got any other Pokemon chilling around here. What is that? Uh, that's a glaring Meowth. But we got this little thing chilling right here. Paralyzed Heal. Can we hop off it? Oh, we can. That's cool. That's cool. Any newbies? Any newbies? There's a trainer around here. And what is that? Okay, that's a Yamper. Do we have a Yamper? I believe we do have a Yamper. But we're chilling. We're going to burst this. Uh, probably another Pikachu. A Joltik. Dude, I love Joltiks. They're little bugs that evolve in the Gavrantula. Choodle, you can do it, dude. Do we risk it here? What level is this thing? It's on 14. We're going to give it a nice quick bite here. See if we can get it. Dang, Electro Web, dude. This thing's strong. Oh! He's quick, too, dude. He's so quick. What'd it do? Our speed fell. Can we get a nice bite off? Yeet. Okay, dude. I'm thinking we can survive the next hit. I'm thinking we can survive the next hit. Bug Bite's not going to kill us. We're chilling. That's fine. We're going to actually finish off this Joltik. Dude, Joltics are awesome. Dude, Gravantula, the second stage, is a beast to have on your competitive team. If you have, like, all good IVs and stuff, he has some awesome moves, and he's really quick, so he's a good, like, starter Pokemon to get out there and maybe get some, like, webs out there and all that good stuff. Grubbin. We're going with Grubbin. We're going to, um, we're going to switch Pokemon out to our Thwax. Get in there, Thwax. 
what we got. But I want to see what this TM is. Hopefully, we get something good. Something that we can use. Oh, that's Grubbin. A little Grubbin. <laughs> he evolves into um some bug Pokemon, like a nasty flying and electric bug. Take him out. Ooh, he's on like one. He's legit on one. He's gonna give us the bug bite. Nom, 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 nom. Super effective to us, dang. This guy's all about the bug and electric, guys. I swear, I swear. We're, we're gonna double hit him up, and then we're gonna go grab that um, what's it called? That team. I believe we do have Yamper. I believe I caught him in the beginning. I might check our uh, Pokedex. But now I believe we did. I believe we did. Well, let's go. Let's grab ourselves this TM right here. Yo, watch this. Do you, you see this electric coming after me? And we got Pin Missile, which is a nice bug move. Not bad, but I believe we did catch the uh, Yamper, so I'm just going to leave him alone to get out of here, Yamper. Actually, I'm going to give it a quick peek. I'm going to give it a quick peek. Did we catch a Yamps? Should be up towards the top. Let's go Sizzlepeed, Magikarp. Where's Yamps? I'm thinking we did, dude. I'm almost positive we did. Stuffle, Mudbray, Delibird, Snow Run, Volpix, Electric, Joltik, Badoo, Oddish, Funnel Be Yamper. Yeah, we did catch a Yamper, dude. Like I said, like I said, dude, I know my things. I know my things, but let's hit it. Let's get out of here. Let's start. Oh, there's. Just, oh, no. I was going to say, is that a secret encounter? Look at these Galarian meows. <gasps> there's a secret encounter here. Let's see what we got. Hopefully, it's something we don't have yet. Hunk of junk. <laughs> dude, they're chasing after me. They're chasing after me. You see this? All right, let's explore this last little part over here. Oh, we got Yamper there. Anything over here? Anything chilling over here? Oh, Pokeball. Ooh. I think we got everything. Sharp Beak. Oh, that powers up flying type moves. Let's hit this fishing spot. Let's hit this fishing spot, dude. Show me something. Oh, I pulled out too quick. Dang it. Mm. Poo poo. <laughs> I, I was just mashing the A button and I clicked it instead. Let's see. We got anything? Yamper's chilling over here. Got some Pokemon. I'm tired of these Pokemon chasing me. They're getting annoying. <laughs> these Galarian Meows just run every no matter what. We got a Nest Ball. What else we got over here? Got a question mark. What is that? A Pikachu? Okay. What else? Is that it? I think it said we got this berry tree. I'm not too worried about it. I think that's all the Pokemon we can get in here. So let's get moving on. We're going to go heal up our Pokemon back in the uh, Pokemon Center before we get going. Let's actually check over here real quick. See if we got any Pokeballs. Punkaboo. There's a Pokeball chilling here. I just heard the Diglets. I ain't too worried about the Diglets. Oh, dip sucker. Let's go. I'm trying to dip this Pokemon. We got a pile of silver powder. And we actually hit this random encounter. What is it? Oh! <gasps> Yes, dude, a Badoo! We don't have one of these boys. Let's go. We can actually catch this Badoo real quick and then get moving along. We're poisoned. We are poisoned, but we're going for this catch right here. We do not have a Badoo yet, which is nice. We're going to be moving on to the next path over there, and there's so many more new Pokemon. Another critical catch? Are you serious, dude? Now that we healed up our Pokemon and caught everything on Route 4 and did what we want to do, we're going to start heading over. Ooh, we got this little thing right here. I get sidetracked real easily, but we're going to be start heading over to the next area where the second gym is actually located. So if we just make a right out of this town right here, we can actually keep going over here. It is on Route 5. And we got these double battle right off the bat. Let's get it. I got my Choodle and my Corvus Squire as the two Pokemon going out here. So we're just going to go get them. I can't wait to get a new Pokemon, dude. Woo! I cannot wait, dude. He's such a cool new Pokemon. I Like, he looks strong. He's like two types that, like, you would never expect go together. You guys will see what I'm talking about in a second. But we got our Choodle going out here. Oh, we got to take out that Helio top so it doesn't mess up our Choodle. Let's go. We're going to just go straight after it. We're going to go, uh, we're going to bite the Helio top. We're just going to double hit that Helio top. And we're gonna, oh, no, no, no. I don't want to peck. We're going to go, uh, power trip. We're going to power trip this Helio top once again. And just rip him up. Let's get him. Yo, boop, boop, boop. Oh, dude, we're not gonna take him out. Oh, he's level. I didn't even realize. Oh, dude, he rips up on both these guys. Just Helio top. Flying and water, dude. He has the best advantage right here. Come on. Oh, dude, Choodle's doing some work. Choodle will actually be able to. He has an electric move, too. Are you kidding me? Wow, dude. Wow, they're ripping. They are ripping up right now. But Choodle will actually be able to take out. What's it called? This Helio top. And then we're just gonna send. Oh, all these moves are like not very effective to this clink. But it's good. We'll take a hit. Maybe this dark move will do some damage. Nope. Stinks. We need our boy. Oh, no, dude. No, Corvus Squires down to four health. At least he's going to get some XP right here for this Helio top right here. Or Helio tile. He's such a cool Pokemon. Hopefully, we can catch him too. That'd be nice. Everyone's gaining XP. Everybody out here gaining XP. He's going to charge beam and take out our Corvus Squire, which is fine. We'll just revive him after this battle. And then we'll get moving along. But we got to take out this Clink. Bang. Bye, Corvus Squire. <laughs> it's good. Get out here, Thwax. Get out here, boy. Now they messed with us. 
Now they're done. Now we're bringing out Big Dog the Wacky over here. He's gonna rip him up. We're gonna water gun this clink. And then we're just gonna hit him with this, uh... Oh, and everything's not very effective. Wow. And it, this steel type messes us up. That's why we need that fire type. That still did pretty decent damage for two not very effective moves. Get this water gun, Choodle. Yeah, this guy's a tank. This guy's a tank. Charge me. Don't you dare hit my Choodle. You can probably take him out. Oh, oh my lord. We're gonna have to take him out here. What's he raising up? His special attack keeps raising. Hopefully we can take him out here. Let's try Bite. Bite, bite usually does work with Choodle. Yo, double hit him again. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> this should actually take him out. We'll chill, we'll chill. Unless he goes first. Nope. Tudor will go first. Bite him up. See you later, Clink. And we'll gain all this experience up. Dude, once he evolves, his defense probably goes through the roof. For Tudor, when he evolves into Dreadnought, because he evolves to a giant turtle. Beating those guys, we actually gave our Thwacky... What's called? Oh, we got some new Pokemon, but... We actually gave our Thwacky a, uh, the Miracle Seed, so his attack or his Grass-type moves are boosted. And we gave... Our, what's it called? Our Corvus Squire, a sharp beak, so his uh, other moves, his flying moves are boosted. But we got this guy. What, I forget the, what this guy's called. He's on there with Swirlix. That's what it is. We're going to capture him up. Let's get it. This Swirlix is actually level 21. This thing is pretty dang strong. It was doing a lot of damage to myself. But I don't know if we just need to be training more in order to move along. If not, we'll do that in a little bit. We'll just train up. But I think we'll be fine. I think it was just that wild Pokemon ended up being a higher level than normal. Bum, bum, bam, 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 bam. But I gave a lot of experience. Here we go. Shoot a level 20, baby. Two more levels. Let's get it. I found this Esper just chilling in a what? It was a random encounter right here. So it wasn't like floating around on the top. Like as you can see the Pokemon. I just had Stuffles running around me. I just went for it. And we got new Pokemon. So let's get it. Yeah. All right. We're going to bounce out here after catching this Esper. But look, look at this dude. The Stuffles chase after us. They're hilarious. But we're going to bounce over to here. And right over here, we actually have the Egg Hatchery place over here. If you make your way inside this building, we're going to get this brand new Pokemon that I want. And it's this little boy right here. Let's talk to this lady. It's a Toxel. A real Toxel. I found an egg and I carried it around with me and it hatched into a Toxel. Why don't you raise it? It's a real shocking Pokemon. Boom! We got ourselves Toxel. This is a Pokemon that I want on my team, actually. Look at him, dude. He is sick. We're gonna add him to our Pokedex. He is electric and poison. I gotta see his nature. We're gonna add him to our party, actually. Because his nature depends on what kind of, um, uh, what's it called? what he evolves into because there's two different forms of them there's ant form and like low-key form so let's see he actually starts on level one and he's gonna give us she's gonna actually give us xp candies actually level him up also too which we are gonna be showing that off right now xp candies you just hand them to him and it's basically free xp which is just dope so let's go into our party i actually want to see all of his stats and all that good stuff what we got he's level one right here let's check out his uh summary let's see what nature he is does it say his nature? Or do we have to go over a bit? He is rattled. I don't know which one that one is. But it's fine. It's fine. Oh, he has nuzzle, growl, flail, and acid. That's a pretty good start. That's a pretty good start. But if we go into our bag now, we can actually pull out XP candies and actually level this boy up. I actually have a few saved up. So let's go over to candies. We have two XPs. Or we have these right here. We're going to use it. Th uh, these candies right here. We're going to use it on Toxel. Let's just... Should we give him... Let's give him 14. See how much that does. Oh, brings him up to level 13, which is just awesome. We're going to give him more. We're going to give him the rest of these, which will just be nice. Bring him up to level with us right here. Let's give him these bigger ones right here. We're going to use this. We're going to use uh, both of them on, on him. Let's see what level we get him to. Let's see what we got. Where you at, Toxel? Ooh, nice little level 16. That's awesome. We can start leveling him up more and more. We actually have to get him to level 32 evolved, but that's awesome, dude. Let's go, dude. We have an electric type and an poison type now which is nice we can double up but we got this train we're gonna start heading down to this little area right down here we're gonna capture some new pokemon then get going to the right towards the town but we got this trainer boy we got breeder adrian right here breeder adrian sending out a stuffle let's see what level these guys are on let's see if we can handle this i think i think we're good i think we should still be above or close to it oh yeah we're good we're up by three levels that's that's good we're gonna water gun dude stuff was so cool dude Stuff was like the happiest Pokemon out there. Look at his face. Brutal swing. Jeez. <laughs> but, dude, he's got some mean moves, too. We're just going to keep uh, water gunning him. We might have to switch out, dude. I got to keep Trudel alive. I got to keep getting him XP. But we might actually switch out to our boy, Toxel. Get him his first kill or something like that. Just keep ripping up. But, dude, yeah, Toxel is going to be part of our team. I've, he evolves into Toxtricity, which is like a bigger form of him. He looks so cool. I cannot wait to show you guys. We're just going to keep open. Is he going to take us out? We're going to have to switch it. No! Oh! God dang it, dude. Our Choodle went down. 
Our Chudol went down. We're going to switch to our Toxel. Have our Toxel finish up this Snuffle right here. And then probably just uh, whack it or Quiver Squire this battle out. But look at this guy. Dude, he's sick. We're going to Nuzzle. He's a little bit of Nuzzle action. Ooh. He's a little bit quicker. Jeez. Doing damage. Oh, what's Rattle do? What does this do? His speed raises when he gets hit. Ooh. He's going to be a fast boy. Nuzzle did like absolutely nothing, but it did paralyze. I'll take that. I'll take that. We should be faster. We're going to acid up. Let's get some acid going. Really, dude? You're going to potion up? I'm trying to get my kill with my Toxel right here. But he's just going to potion up. Let's see how much damage this acid does. Ooh. Get it. That a boy, dude. That was nice. What's that lower? His special defense. So this next attack should do more. Let's get it. Yeah, dude. We're faster now, too. Yes, Toxel. Finish him out. There we go. Perfect. We dropped this special defense and finished him off with Toxel. He's pretty strong with that acid move. I like that. Let's get it. Oh, big points for him. 245. Core Squire to level 21. Um, sadly, our Meowth leveled up. Enter Toxel to 2. Meowth, I don't care about what moves you want. We're going to keep your old moves because you're not learning anything. <laughs> He's about to send out Rolts. We're actually going to switch out to Thwacky, dude. Let's get some Thwacky action in here. So we're just going to clean up this battle. Give him the quick whoppings. Rolts. I would love to catch a Rolts, dude. Gardevoir's a beast. And Gallade's a beast, too. We're going to raise the leaf it up. You get slamming, dude. I, oh, dude, I wish our Chudo was still alive. Oh, one hit. <laughs> Eaten up. Because our Chudo does need the XP. He's such a lightweight, dude. Until he evolves. Cutie Fly. Um, We're going to switch out to our Corvus Squire right here. And our Corvus Squire is just going to light it up with a flying move. Probably one hit it, and then we'll be done. But we got some new Pokemon in this route. Once we go down, we'll be able to catch it or capture them all. We'll get them up real quick. But look at a cutie fly, dude. He's normal. <laughs> I don't think cutie fly evolves, which is pretty funny. He's just that thing until level 100. <laughs> Pluck. Dead. Merc. But cutie fly, I think it's, he's actually a really good, uh, what's it called? Competitive Pokemon. He can be used for good things. There we go. Get all that XP. We can finish off this trainer right here and get moving along. All right, let's hit the balance of boogie, guys. Let's go. We got another trainer. I want to whoop on her. What's up? What you want? All right. Who we got? Please have, like, what's it called? Fire Pokemon? <laughs> Breeder Debra. Right here. A Messino. Ooh, we haven't seen one of these. A little Messino action. We're going to bite it up. Look at that. Bite might be super effective. It might. You don't use pound. That was a tail slap, dog. That was a tail slap. Biting him up. Well, almost half. What's cute trying to do? We really fall in love. You kidding me? We're gonna have to switch out. I'm not dealing with this whole love thing. Get in there, Thwax. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that. Falling in love with the Pokemon? They literally sit there like, <laughs> you Get this Razor Leaf going. We'll take out this. This should take it out right here. Ye See you later, Mincino. Mincino! What's the next Pokemon? Hopefully we can get some Toxel love up in here. We level up Thwacky, dude. Cutie Fly, I don't care about you, Cutie Fly. <laughs> About to send out Steeny. Steeny is a, another grass type. We should have just actually switched to what's it called? Quiver Squire there. But we'll hit the, up this uh, double hit right here. I wonder what other moves um, Wacky or Rillaboom will actually uh, get up. Is that with like a nice, like, hard hitting move that's other than grass? Boom, boom. Oh, we're playing nice. What's that do again? Oh, it lowers our attack, doesn't it? Yep, lowers our attack. But we're still gonna hit that double hit. Yo, give him a quick sign. Nope. Boom. And then one more double hit should actually finish off this steam right here. Unless she uses that again. Nope. Razor Leaf. It's gonna do nothing. Nothing, dog. Get out of my face. Here comes another one. See you later. Boy, use a potion just to annoy me. Don't make me pull out Core of Squire. I'll do it. Give me a crit. Crit up or something. Yeah. Oh, he critted it. Yo, he did. He did it, dude. He was listening. He's like, you got it, Jeans. You got it. I'm gonna crit this fool. Let's go. Nice experience right there. Who leveled up? My boy Toxel. But the weird thing is Toxel didn't learn any moves. I think it was because he was an egg Pokemon. So we kind of just like had moves already. Get Nuzzle and Acid and all that good stuff. But let's keep grooving along. What other Pokies we got? Oh, we got a fishing spot. Let's hit this up. What we got? Show me a new water Pokemon instead of Magikarp. I don't want to face a Magikarp. Who we got? Bruh. Yeah, screw that Magikarp. I ain't dealing with him. Any newbies over here? We got some stuff. With <gasps> a Wobbuffet. This is the Wubbuffet. Should we catch him? Or should we wait to get his first stage? Let's go catch him. Stuffle, what are you doing? <laughs> Where you at, Wubbuffet? 
Wow, a fat. Get in here, big dog. Let's get him, dude. Look at him. <laughs> Wow, that's the man, dude. Look at him just chilling. But he has a first stage. Why not? That's why I was like seeing if we should catch him or not. Is he what type is he? He looks like a water, but I don't think he's a water. Oh, that did some damage, but I know he has a heaping amount of health. That was a crit, too. Jeez, this guy's a tank. I'm gonna use safeguard. Jesus. He's gonna cloak himself into a mystical veil. But this guy's gonna step up on his defense. Jeez, dude. He's a tank. Counter. Oh, no. Whooped. Whooped my chudo. That's it. Yeah, we got to use the next Pokemon. We're trying to catch this thing. Let's get out there, uh, Corvus Squire. Jesus, come on, man. Come on, Baba Fat. Had to do my chudo dirty. I need to evolve him quick, dude. I should have used the, uh, the thing on him. Some of the EXP candies because he's just a lightweight right now. I cannot wait to evolve him. That did nothing. We're going to hit him with another pet because I feel like he's going to be harder to catch. Because he's a bigger boy. He's a bigger boy. Come here, Wobbuffet. Get in this Pokeball. Get in here, dog. One. Come on, give me the three. I feel like he's going to pop out. No? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Hey, now that we got that Wobbuffet, we're just going to keep moving along. We got this Berry Tree and we have this Trainer over here. Hello, trainer. Wait, what Pokemon is this? <gasps> a Mincino! I'm gonna catch this thing first. <laughs> I was like, we should go get this trainer. But then I saw a question mark behind the tree. I was like, let's go check it out. We're going for the early Pokeball. Mincino is still in green health, but we're going for it. I'm thinking we can catch it. It's a, it's an early game Pokemon. Oh, yeah, dude. You see, I'm calling this, dude. We're doing good. We're rocking out. All right, let's grab this Pokeball over here now before we versus Trainer. What is up on this path right here? I think it just, it was the other path when we were versing near the other guys, right? Yeah. Okay, so this is just another path. Oh, a Wobbuffet's up there. And what is that? Mincino again. Okay. We're chilling, we're chilling. Let's head back down here. We got this Trainer. We're going to go battle up real quick. I want to get a Wild Encounter because I feel like there's got to be another Pokemon here. What we got here? Who we got? Stupid Pokemon. Not dealing with the Swirlixes. We're going to battle this Trainer right here and level up our Tootle. He's actually like... 1 XP away from going 21, dude. I'm hyped to get him to 22. We'll definitely get him to 22 by the end of this episode right here. Well, let's go. He's sending out Appwin, dude. My boy Appwin, dude. I want one of them. Let's go. Let's fight him. We're going to go. Oh, he's grass type. Let's switch him out. Get in there, Corvus Squire. Because he's grass type, and then I believe he evolves into grass and dragon, which is a cool combination considering we don't have many of them. Corvus Squire. Oh, yeah, Corvus Squire. Let's get it. It's unnerve. Unnerve. What's he going to do? He's going to withdraw. He's going to raise his defense up here. Which is a nice little starter move. Let's go. Let's hit him with this pluck. I think he's just grass, right? Yep, he's just grass. <laughs> but if he didn't raise his defense up, he was dead. He's going to astonish us now. I love that move. He just like... Been in it. <laughs> just gives us a quick peek and then we're done. Which is hilarious. Bill, Bill. Right, there we go. Merc on this fool. See you, Apple, and he's dead. How much XP does he get? I feel like he gives a nice amount. Oh, not bad, not bad. They were Chudel actually leveled up. And our Toxel did, which is awesome. Chudel wants to learn Headbutt. Yes, give that to Chudel. We're going to get rid of a tackle. We won't need tackle anymore once we got Headbutt. Beautiful. Does Toxel want to learn anything? Hopefully, Toxel wants to learn like Thunder. <laughs> Toxel grew to level 19. Awesome. Cool. We defeated Cook Stewart over here. We're actually gonna go shake this tree after this. Aren't there trees like berry trees? Berry trees. These Pokemon keep attacking me, dog. That's not berry tree. <laughs> we'll have to go shake that berry tree. Let's shake this berry tree right here. Look at all these Pokemon. Yeah, I want to shake it. Let's shake it down. One berry, dude. We're shaking it again. We're going for the massive amounts of berries. We're shaking it again. <laughs> I kind of want to see what Pokemon would fall out of here. Nine berries? Is it risking it? More berries, yo! <laughs> I want to see what Pokemon comes out of here. Yeah, what we got? What we got? Oh, Squovit! Dang it! I was hoping for like Applin or something because I know Applin can pop out of trees. We're just gonna, we're just gonna run from this punk. All right, let's keep moving along here. Can we shake the tree once again or no? Nope, all the berries went away. Oh no, we got some berries. We got five. Oh my god, we still got all the berries. Eee, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Any other berry trees before we hit the bounce boogie and skididdles? No, but I think we'll do one more random encounter. Who we got? Who we got? 
Who we got? Oh, we already got Esper. We already got her. All right, let's get out of this area now. We're going to make our way up here and then go towards the right to the new town. Oh, yeah. What else we got? I think we got another uh, route over here. Oh, look at this. We got a team yell battle. What's good, dude? Let's get whooping on these fools, dude. I'm sick of them. Then we're going to have to go across this bridge. Dude, there's probably a beautiful view off the bridge, which I'm hyped for. What's up, team yell? What you fools want? Oi, we're not trying to steal the bike. Only borrow it. Uh, they're trying to steal this guy's bike, but we're going to have to give him the quick whoopings real quick. Let's show him what's up. Team Yell, you're cha challenged by Team Yell Grunt. What you want? Zigzagoon, dude. Zigzagoon. My Choodle with his new headbutt's gonna have to give you a whoopings. Let's level this bad boy up. Let's give him a headbutt. Headbutt time. Baby doll eyes. What's, it, what's that lower attack, I think? Special attack? Just our regular attack. Oh, that goes towards our headbutt. Choodle, boom. Nice damage, Choodle. My man. I think Chudo has nice uh, regular attack, but his special attack isn't too good. Well, let's go. He's going to snarl us. Do some damage, but Chudo's actually fending for himself right here. Doing some work. We're just going to bite him and finish him off here. Even though it's not very effective, it should still be able to kill him. He's going to baby doll eye us. What do you mean? It's fine, Chudo. It's fine. You're getting switched off after this because your attack and stuff slow. Take him out. Yes, all right, cool. Zigzagoon is dead. Glaine Zigzagoon. He's like a zebra. But Linoon looks sick. Valerian Linoon looks awesome. But there we go. Get some experience. Who does he send out next? The Evil, which is a dark type. We're just going to switch out to our Thwacky. And our Thwacky's going to do work. We actually might use our Tox Toxel at the second gym instead of our Thwacky, the water gym, in order to get him levels. Like, he can just nuzzle up and just whoop on them all. You know what I'm saying? Then we have Thwacky for uh, backup. Oh, look at Thweevil, dude. He's Nick. It's final stage right here. We're going to Razor Leaf him because he's just a dark type. We're going to rip him up. What you mean? Did he dodge Razor Leaf? I throw Razor's and leaves all over the place. <laughs> Let's try this again. Let's try it again. Razor Leaf. Yeah. Yeet die. Ooh, dude. Crit it again, dude. My boy Thwaggy is on today. He's absolutely on. But there we go. We can finish off this grunt. But is this the only grunt we have to battle? Oh, who leveled up? Thwacky and Meow. Toodle's getting there. Thwacky wants to learn knockoff. I'm actually going to learn this to him. Let's see what move we can get rid of. We're going to get rid of Growl. So if any Pokemon's holding an item like these gym battles and all that, we can just smack it off real quick. And it usually flinches them too, which is nice. So it's a good start off move. We can knock off some items and all that. Well, let's go. We defeated the Team Yell Grunt. Hopefully we don't have to burst the other one. That would be lame. Because they were trying to steal this fool's bike. What's the other one going to step up? God, you crushed my attempt to crush you. Why you? I want that bike. Don't get in my way. Okay, we got to burst the other one. What's he want? We got another Team Yell Grunt. Little fools. Sableye. A little Sableye action off the back. What's Sableye? Is he just dark? I think he's just dark. We're going to try to use a headbutt with him. What level is this thing? 18. It's the only Pokemon. Hopefully he doesn't kill my Toodle because I feel like the Sableye could give out a ton of it. It doesn't affect him. Oh, it's like Ghost. You know, scratches. We're going to have to switch out. We're going to have to switch out here. Who's going in? Corvus Squire. Get in there, dog. Get in there, Corvus Squire. <laughs> We're just going to get whapping on him. Nice little weapon action. Disable. What are you going to disable? I was going to say it failed. <laughs> Alright, let's give him this pluck action. Do some damage. Pluck. Milk. Nice damage, dude. Pass that halfway mark. Beautiful. We can two shot him. Say night night, dude. Yeet. Another little plucky plucky. Milk. 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 Dead. Murked. Screw that guy. Anyone level up? And let's see the XP. Oh my lord, so much XP. Choodle is getting there. Corvus Squire did level up, which is nice. Oh, I'm ready to get my Dreadnought, dude. Ready. All right, let's roll out. These Team Yell Grunts are out of here. We whooped on them. They're dead. Let's see. Hopefully this guy gives us a reward or something. What you get for us? My word, you're quite the trainer. And I see you have a Pokedex too. That means you have a Rotom with you. Fantastic. I think I'll give you this bike. Bro, we got a bike. We got a bike. Which I'm hype. Enjoy cycling, he tells us. Come on now. You ride the Rotom bike together. Cool. We obtained the Rotom bike, which is awesome. Rotom can actually just like turn into a bike. I believe if we just hit the plus button, yeah. We can actually hop on our little cycle. Yeah. Oh <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna hop off this bike. Oh, we got like a turbo boost. How do we hop off the bike? Okay, minus hops off the bike. But we got these little sparkles on the bridge. A genius feather. Okay, cool, cool, cool. <gasps> but like I said, look at this view out here. Look at this view. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, guys? Bruh, I cannot wait to go explore down there. Absolutely phenomenal, dude. This game's too good. 
Oh, but we got a boy Hop right here. I'm warning you, though. Any closer than that, we're gonna have to battle. Oh, we're gonna have to battle him? Okay, so that's like a warning right there for us to heal up and all that. I'm just gonna heal up my Choodle. I think we'll be fine with the rest. Choodle, take a potion. You're gonna take another potion. You're gonna We're gonna make sure he is alive right here. But we're battling Hop once again, dude. I feel like we battle Hop all the time, dude. What's up, dude? We, you're done, dude. You're out of here. We're gonna whoop on you again. He knows that for a fact, dude. Challenged by Trainer Hop once again. He's gonna send out his Wulu. He still has three Pokemon. We're up to four, dog. We're up to four. But yo, let's get this. Our Chudo's gonna level up here. Let's have a taste of what a gym battered holders can do. I'm, I'm gonna whoop on you. <laughs> He's done. He's done. Let's get him with his headbutt. Yeah, get him, Chudo. Boom. Nice damage, buddy. Nice damage, Chudo. Takes a nice little roll tackle from Wulu. We're gonna headbutt him up again. Chudo's gonna take this Wulu on all by himself. I wonder if... Oh, is that a crit? Oh, I thought it was gonna be a crit. But I wonder if he um, actually evolved this Sobble yet. Because we have not seen that... Or not Sobble. Is it Sobble? Yeah. He hasn't evolved this Sobble yet. We haven't seen that second stage yet. Woo! Hopefully he did. He had to have now. What did he just use? A potion? A super potion? You're a chump, dude. Big chump over here, Hop. Yo, keep head button. He actually raised his defense. We're gonna try to go with this bite. Should we use bite? Nom. And it didn't do as much as I wanted it to. Double kick. Wulu can stand on his feet and kick you. That's funny. <laughs> Let's go back to the headbutt action. Headbutt's probably Chudo's strongest move, dude. He rips out. Ooh, nice hit. Nice hit. Oh, flinched him too. That's night night, dude. See ya, Wulu. You're dead. Feel. See ya later, punk. Who you got next? We're probably just gonna switch out to a wacky. Because who does he have? Does he have the uh, Corvus Squire? I forget who it was. Chudo's so close. If we just switch him out, I know he has that Sobble. He has Corvus Squire, so we're just gonna switch to actually Toxel right here. Because he has an electric move, and he can take out these birdie boos. Yes, dude. Toxel, dude. My boy, dude. Like, I don't, I can't think of a poison and electric type besides him. That's why I saw him, and I just thought he was so cool. I was like, I have to get him on my team. Such an awesome combo, poison and electric. That's so cool. Let's go. We're gonna hit him with Nuzzle. Oh, he's faster than us. Oh, we dodged it. That a boy Toxel. Let's him up. Oh, that didn't even do too much. Dang it. You stink. <laughs> Nuzzle's just not that strong of a move, but it did paralyze. I'll take that. Let's see if Acid does any more. Let's try it. Even though it's not super effective. I don't think it should, but it might. No, it does do more. That's nice. Beautiful. Oh. And we're dropping his special defense, so we're going to hit harder next time, too. He's going to peck us up. We're fine. We're chilling. Not very effective. Get out of my face. Acid him again. Fan into him. Oh, yeah. Look at that damage, dude. And he's paralyzed, dude. See you, Corvus Squire. You're dead. Our Chudel and our Toxel is going to level up here. And then we're just going to get out our uh, Thwacky to finish off this uh, Sobble. Or it might not be a Sobble. It might be a second stage. I don't know what it's called, though. Let's go. A lot of people leveling up. Three levels. Chudel's going to evolve after his Tox levels up to 20 and Cutie 5 to 22. Or Cutie 5 to 19. Chudel to 22. His name's Drizzile. Drizzle? Drizzile? Get out here, Thwax. Oh, yes, dude. <laughs> Let's see this thing, dude. I saw pictures of it, but I didn't get to see it in-game yet. So I'm actually pretty hyped. Let's go. This is his ace, dude. My ace perfectly counters your ace. Like, what you want? What you want, dude? Look at Drizzile, dude. He looks sick, though. I like I like how he looks, but we're just going to Razor Leaf him. Say, see you later, dude. He's dead. <laughs> Oh, he's on one. Of course he's on one. He's gonna use growl. What's he throw at us? You see he like threw something. He didn't even growl. Our attack fell, but it's all good. We're gonna branch poke him. Like in the good old days. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, did you see Thwacky's animation? He was like, whack, whack, whack. He whacked him with his sticks, dog. So I like to see Thwax. But there we go. Finish off the battle. Everyone gets mean experience. Let's go. But let's go, dude. Our, our what's it? I can't even forget his name now. What, what's his name? The, the turtle guy's gonna evolve. There we go. What's his name? Chudo. It's Chudo. That's what it is. Chudo is evolving. Let's go, dude. To my boy Dreadnought. To a giant turtle. Giant alligator snapper. Yes. Your Chudo evolved to Dreadnought, dude. He's sick. Is he gonna learn a move? Is he gonna learn a move? He's a beast, dude. I would love for him to learn, like, Crunch or something. That'd be nice. Oh, what's he learning? Rock Tomb. Oh, okay. Let's go, dude. That's a good move, because he turns to rock and water now. What are we going to get out of here? Let's get protect, dude. We don't even use protect. <laughs> but let's go, dude. One, two, and ta-da! 
We learned rock tomb. So now we can drop rocks on birds and stuff. So it's nice. My boy, dude, dreading all up in here. But you've gotten strong, Gene. Seems like I got to train harder from now on. Yeah. Been head telling you that, big dog. Oh, he gives us a revive. Nice, nice, nice. All right, we're going to still keep our Dreadnought in the top spot right here. Because I actually want to test him out. Next Pokemon we see. Let's go. Let's keep walking around here. Dreadnought, dude. I can't wait to use him. But, dude, I cannot wait to actually go down there and explore that part of the wild area. Like, jeez. Jeez, oh, I saw a shiny little item. Health Feather. Okay. Oh, look at that Pokemon. That, that's the evolution of, uh, what's it called? Someone else. What is that? What is this thing? Oh, that's a that's a swirl. I was gonna say I never seen that thing, but we got a trainer right here. We're gonna use our dreadnought to actually whoop on this trainer and then start making our way. I, th I believe the town is right over to our right, so I think once we beat this trainer, we we can actually be able to go over to the town where the second gym, the water gym, is lying. <gasps> a cherub, a cherub. I think they're just cherubs. Dude, he's an absolute beast. Let's bite him up. He's probably so much better now. My man, dude, look at him. He's dealing a heaping amount of damage now. I love Dreadnought, dude. His defense is through the roof. His defense is through the roof. They just did one damage to him with a not very effective move. Dead, dude. Oh, yes, dude. My boy Dreadnought in the house. He was such a good pick to the team. Now he's just going to stay like this and be on our team forever. Everyone's gaining XP. Any more pokies you got? What? It, I don't even know what he said. We're just going to keep Dreadnought out here. He's fun to use. A Woobat. Oh, and we have Rock Tomb. We get to show that off. It will be super effective. We might be able to one-shot. And bite super effective to him, too. But I'd rather show off Rock Tomb. Avoid it? How do you avoid Rock Tomb? Get out of my face, dude. <laughs> Does nothing, dude. They do these such a defense tank, dude. Absolutely love him. Merc, dude. One hit him, dude. Like I said, dude, he's one of the uh, Pokemon. Once you evolve him, he's going to be a lot stronger. Bye, Woobat. Dead, murked. See you later. Now he's pushing closer levels to everyone else. Let's get it, nigga. Alright, let's get this Pokeball. Any other new Pokemon over here? I don't think so. I don't think so. I guess we'll check a few uh, random encounters. Actually, we got this thing right here. Let's check a few random encounters and then get moving along. So I did a few random encounters, and I didn't get anything new or anything, so we're just going to keep moving along. Is this a trainer right here? Yeah, dude, our Dreadnought is going to have to whoop on it, get some more XP, and I believe the town is literally just to the right. So then we're going to head over there, heal up and all that good stuff, and face off in our second gym challenge. Which I'm hyped, dude. Back-to-back -back videos doing gym challenges? I'm down, I'm down. Ooh, a Crow Gunk. A Crow Gunk, dude. We call it, I think we're pushing 40 Pokemon now, which is awesome. But actually, did we have a first one of these? No. I think we're just going to headbutt it, play it safe. Normal move. Actually, it might poison us. Does he have that ability? Oh, he flinched it in a move, dude. <laughs> Dreadnought. I love him, dude. I love him. He's so worth a bob that Choodle, like, going through all that pain. I feel, I feel like he's kind of like a magic card. Like, Choodle was such a lightweight, dying everything. Now he's just tanking up and whooping. Everyone's leveling up. Toxel just gave us a nice little level. Let's go. But I heard Toxtricity is one of the strongest guys in this, like, he's a stronger Pokemon within this game, which is just nice. Let's keep moving along here. Anything else? Ooh, going out of here. Is this a town? Is this a town? I believe it is. I believe it is. Do, 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 do. Or we might have to keep uh, moving along. Let's see. No, it is a town. We are at Holbury, which is the next town. As you can see, there was the water gym right over here. <gasps> the elephant Pokemon. I saw him. He's cool. But, dude, it is like a harbor, dude. This looks beautiful. I, this is my favorite town so far. It looks so cool. All right, let's hit up this uh, Pokemon shop right off the bat, and then we'll start making our way towards the gym. And go do that. Dude, this place is sick. This place is sick. We're actually going to heal up our Pokemon, and then we're going to, what's it called? I'm going to buy a few things from the Mart. Look at that Dreadnought, dude. Dreadnought. We're actually going to put, uh, I'm going to see if I have any TMs either. Do I, do I have any electric TMs? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. Let's check. Let's go to our bag. Check our TM bag. Any electric moves? Rock Blast, Scary Face, Magical Leaf, Pen Missile, no, beat up. And Toxel, Toxel can't even learn anything. I don't think Toxel can do much until he's fully evolved. But that's okay. We're going to actually buy some uh, more Pokeballs. Let's see. Let's get some Pokeballs up in here. I, I like just using the regular Pokeballs. They're cheaper. We're going to buy 21 of them because we're running low on them. And then we'll buy a few Great Balls and some Potions in the mix too. We'll buy five Great Balls for like big dogs if they come around. Let's get some Super Potions. Oh, nope. No Burn Heals. Super Potions. We'll buy 11 of them. Yeah, that's fine. We're racking up the cash, so we're chilling. 
Okay, now let's hit the bounce and boogie and get out of here. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> let's go. Let's see what's right here. Ooh, I see the uh, champion guy. What is it? The commissioner of the Pokemon League. Let's talk to him. And we got Rose right here. Let's talk to these fools. After talking to the chairman right there, he was just saying how after we beat second gym, he's going to throw us a big party. Yeah. Actually, I want to head down here before we actually go towards that gym right there and complete that gym challenge. What's down here? We got any goodies down here? Oh, look at all this. What we got all around here? A little Pokeball. I'll take that. Nice little magnet. Boost electric type moves. Might have to give that to my boy Toxic before we actually head inside here. I wonder if we got all these different shops right here. What is this? Let's talk to this lady. Get a whiff of that fragrance. How about... Oh, we can buy some incenses right here. Let's see. An item. It doubles any prize money received. Oh, yes. Dude, we might have to get this. You think it's a good purchase? I don't know. It will be a good purchase in the long run. We're going to get it. We're going to get it and give it to somebody in a little bit. We're going to buy this luck incense right here. Yeah, yeah. We're going to buy one of them. Yes. We're going to be doubling our cash, dude. We're going to give it to probably our Thwacky right here before we actually enter that gym, which is nice. Because we'll probably be using him and our Toxel a lot. So we can double all of our gym battle money stuff. But let's get it, dude. That's cash. That's going to be easy money making back. Let's head over to this gym right here. But we got this lady in front. I'm guessing we can't just walk straight into it. Let's see what she says. You must be a gym challenger, right? If you're looking for the gym leader, Nessa, she's off at the lighthouse. The lighthouse is well... If you head towards the sea from here, you shouldn't be able to miss it. Okay, so I'm guessing the sea is towards the right because there was nothing to the left. Let's go. Let's get over here. But look at this place. We're right on like a harbor, right on a beach. Well, what do we got down here? What do we got down here? <gasps> Ooh, a nice little fishing area and some Pokeballs. Let's see if we get any new water Pokemon. We got some net balls, which are good for getting some uh, water type Pokemon. Who we got? Can we get some new water types? That'd be nice. Let's see. Give me someone. What we got? Who we got here? Who's chilling here? Oh, new water type. Yes. A bass coolant. Ooh. Look at this. We got an Aerocuda right here. Actually ended off killing up or killing that other Pokemon on accident. But we're going to catch this guy. He's going to Aqua Jet. Oh, is he part ground? Bro, he just crit it on our Toxel right here, which is quite annoying. So we're going to nuzzle him up, do some damage. But we're going to have to switch out here. Oh, we paralyzed him though. That's not bad. Not bad. Yeah, we actually ended up killing the other Pokemon, which I'm kind of sad about. We're going to switch out into our uh, Corvus Squad right here. Knock him down a little bit. But jeez, of course he crit it right off the bat. What a hunk of junk. Come on. Here comes the lucky throw right here. Come on, we got to catch him. Don't you dare pop out. There you go. One wiggle. Two. Come on, I need this Barracuda Pokemon. Yes, let's go. Let's try to catch that other fish once again. That's what I'm going to go for. Okay, guys, we got... Basculin. We caught him once again. We're going to try to catch him right here. He's down into the yellow. But let's try this. Come on. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Come on. Give me this fishy boy. Yeah. Let's get it. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Nice little chin chow encounter right here. Right on the water, too. We're going to catch this bad boy up. All right. Let's go for this Pokeball here. Come on. Let's catch it. Let's catch it. Yep. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're done with the dock area right here. We grinded that out. Caught three different fish Pokemon right here. Now we're going to head towards the lighthouse over here to go get the water gym leader right here. And here she is just chilling by the lighthouse. Let's see what she has to say. You must be a gym challenger, right? How'd you know? You're, you're one of those endorsed by Leon, right? You've become something of a hot topic among gym leaders. Here you go, Mr. Famous. I already heard about you. So you should learn about me too. Okay, so we got her league card. Let's go. She's going to start heading back to the stadium right now. So we can actually go first her in the gym challenge. So let's get on that. Let's go. Let's get it. Let me actually make sure my Pokemon are all healed up. Which we actually might go to the Pokemon Center real quick. Look at this, guys. Got my Pokemon all healed up, ready for this gym challenge. We got our 20, level 26 Thwacky, level 24 Corvus Squire, level 22 Toxel, and our level 23 Dread. And all those are going to be the Pokemon that we were using. The other two are just like the little poop Pokemon just chilling in our party right here. But let's head over here to this gym challenge right here. Let's get it. Yes, we shall get started. I got to go put on my uniform. We're going to go over there and put on that nice little jeans uniform, number 25, baby. Let's get it. <laughs> Let's go, dude. We're ready. I want to see what this challenge is. I think it's going to be cool. Like, what are we going to do? Another one we had to push Wooloos around. I think that was pretty funny. <laughs> Let's see what we have to do now. 
Let's go, dude. Water gym, water gym. Yo, are you kidding me? Look at this. Okay, so I guess we're gonna have to turn off these pipes and all this. Dude, this looks gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Let's get it. It's time. It is time to whoop on this. Bam, ba -dam, bam, 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 bam. The Holberry Pokemon Gym's mission is this: a challenge, a challenging maze, and you must reach the goal to clear the mission. However, some paths are major blocked by water. What should you do then? Try pressing the red button over there, and I imagine you fig figure it out, future champ. Okay, perfect. So we're just gonna have to hit buttons to unlock paths and shut off water valves and all that. Probably, yep, load it up with trainers too. So we're gonna have to go this way and actually start whooping on trainers. We have my Thwacky in the top spot right here with the luck incense. I put the luck incense. He's holding it, so we're gonna get double cash whenever we win these battles. Which is just awesome. Tim Pole, dude. We're just gonna rip. We're just gonna rip here. But this is such a cool gym. Such a cool one. Got Thwacky to rip him up. Get this little rage leaf going. Yeet. Send it dead. Pooped on him. <laughs> I wonder what the gym leader's gonna have. Probably some really cool water Pokemon. Right, some really cool ones nice little level or xp for everybody all right beat the trainer she's like what my temple is amazing <laughs> like no it's not it stinks let's go let's hit this valve right here what's this do hit this one this one oh switches those pants right here and then this will probably turn off the yellow ones okay now we're gonna switch off this red one let's see what this red one does this one red this red one will unlock that path over there and now we're gonna have to go Actually, can we go over there? No, we have to keep going straight this way. Okay, so we make our way this way. We can actually walk around, defeat this trainer right here. Once we defeat this trainer, we can actually get this yellow valve over here. And start turning them all off. I guess that all these little trainers are just going to have like one Pokemon. And then the uh, final trainer or the gym leader is going to have two or three. But a Krabby, dude! We got a Krabby! I want a Krabby on my team. Or not on my team, just like capture it. Have it in my Pokedex. This is gonna be too easy. Razor Leaf. Dead. <laughs> this is so easy. I was gonna use my Toxel, but we got this Luck Incense here. And Toxel isn't really too strong until you start to level him up and all that. His moves aren't too strong. But we got a Core Fish right here. Keep going. We're just gonna, we're just gonna Razor Leaf it up again. It's as simple as that. Look at Core Fish. Core Fish looks hilarious. This Core Fish above in the Crawdon. I believe he does. Yeah, with the big giant claws. <laughs> cool fish is so cool. Let's go. Cutie Fly's gonna level up. I don't really care for her. But there we go. Defeated gym trainer Heather over here. You're dead. Oh, three thousand dollars. Oh, that was basically four thousand dollars for win that battle. This luck incense is already reeling in its dough right now. Let's hit this switch. We're gonna flip it over here, and then we're gonna go over here back to this red button right here. Click this one, then we can walk back around and unlock that path this way. Do 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 do. Oh, I'm liking this. I'm liking these gyms, dude. Phenomenal. I think we gotta find our way yet yeah, to that blue button. That's gonna knock down all three of them. So we got this trainer right here. We're gonna battle. Oh, we can just dip her out. I'm, I still want to battle her though. We're gonna battle her real quick. Get this XP for the squad right here. It's perfect. It's perfect. Dun, 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 dun. But we still do have fly. I gotta remember about that. Ooh, a Ramorain. These things evolve into Octillery. Thwacky. Dude, we're just gonna be race leafing this whole way through. <laughs> Keep it simple, dude. Keep it simple. Out of here. Dude, one hit and the... Dude, Grookey was such a good pick, dude. His attack is through the roof. But his speed... He's, he's the slowest starter. But still, dude, if you... You get hit by him, he's gonna rip you up. Choodle. We're just gonna keep current Pokemon. Choodle's such a lightweight. Oh, they might have a Dreadnought, actually. But we have, we are like double super effective to it, right? all because it's rock and water. We're just gonna branch poke with that. Yeah, I knew that would kill. Such a lightweight Choodle. Dead. <laughs> Merc, anyone leveling up? Nope. Everyone's high. Everyone's getting high levels, dude. Let's go, dude. I'm hype. I'm actually glad we were able to fit this uh, battle in here. This uh, gym battle in this video, which is nice. Let's go over here. We're gonna hit this. Unlock that blue path right here. Now we can actually escape. Right? Yeah, we can actually escape. I actually want to just see what's down there real quick before we uh, actually go ahead of there and face off against the gym challenger. Oh, no, we cannot. We actually have to go all the way around. Okay, because that one switches over there. Let's head this way. We got this yellow path we're going to hit. What's this yellow path do? Yeah, okay, that creates our straight path right there, but how do... We can't escape now, can we? Okay, we hit the red button again. 
Now we get this yellow button going. There we go. We got this yellow button going. Now we unlock the path. Okay, I got it. I got it. Now we're just gonna hit this red button, blue button, and then the middle path will be open. Okay, I got it. I got it. We're chilling. <laughs> All right. Wasn't that hard? Just I was just overthinking it. <laughs> and there we go. We can make a right, make a right right here, and go over there and face off against the gym leader, the water gym leader, which is awesome, dude. These gyms are phenomenal, dude. This game is unreal. It's absolutely unreal, dude. I'm loving it so much. Like, I can't even say it right now. Because my favorite game is Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. And that that hasn't been topped yet. And right now, this is pushing it. This is pushing it. And I haven't even beat the game yet. Which is awesome. But there we go. Into the gym challenge. Right here. Facing off against the gym leader. Let's go. She's actually very cool looking. I think she has like a dope, uh, like kind of like theme to her. Like all that water and then her outfit fits her perfectly and all that. They did a very good job. A very good job with designing her. Let's go. Look at this. Meeting in the middle. We know what's up. We're just like, yo, let's go. But we can actually Dynamax our Thwacky if we wanted to. We're going to get some cash. Welcome, Honored Gym Challenger. I think you already realized, but I'm Nessa. Sorry to have made you look for me. I don't doubt my humble mission difficulties. Yet, you cleared it. Your mind as a Pokemon trainer must be quite refined. No matter what kind of plan your refined mind may be plotting, my partner and I will be sure to sink it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's go. Who's her partner? I wonder. She might have a Dreadnought. I'm trying to think of a big water type that she would have. Dreadnought, like, pops into my mind. Maybe, like, a Sea King or something. A Golding. Yeah, see, a Golding may be a Sea King. I was, I was thinking. But she's done. We won't even, uh, we won't Dynamax right off the bat. But our band is Dynamaxable. Dude, we're just gonna level up our Thwacky here. Just own this gym with him. Level him up, and then we can... Just have him as backup and level up everybody else on the route on the way to the next town. Dun, 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 dun. Let's go, dead. Everyone's gaining XP. Meowth, level up. Meowth, we don't want you to level up. <laughs> Aracuda, dude, we're fine. We're chilling. I feel like when we Dynamax, we're just going to one hit the uh, her final guy. I just have a feeling about that. Whoop it on this gym. Every hit, I think, has been a one hit, right? Just about. Corvus Squire levels up to 25. I wonder when he evolves to Corviknight. A Dreadnought. I knew it had a Dreadnought. We're going to keep our current Pokemon. We actually might not be able to hit in one hit. This defense is real, dude. Like, this thing has me defense. We're going to Dynamax our Thwacky right here. And then hit this Dreadnought with a, um, a big Razor Leaf. Let's go fight. Dynamax. Max Overgrowth. If he doesn't Dynamax, this should be one hit. But I believe she is going to Dynamax here. Let's see. Yay! <laughs> Giant wacky. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, yeah. 109 HP. Look how big his sticks are. Yep. Nessa is going to Dynamax her Dreadnought. Yeah, I knew she had like a Dreadnought or something. Jeez. Giant Pokeball. Uh, it's only level 24. We still should be able to do either half health or just blow this thing out of the water here. But this thing probably has mean health, I'm not gonna lie. This thing's enormous. It looks so cool. Bom, bom, bom. Ooh, I can use Max Overgrowth. Let's see it. Oh! Oh! You kidding me? Are you kidding me? Thwacky just dominate this place. One hit KO'd the Dreadnought and everybody in this whole gym. Dead. Just dead. Thwacky owns him. Thwacky owns it. I wonder how much cash we're going to get with this luck incense. But jeez, the XP is through the roofs. Toxel, Thwacky, and Dreadnought all level up, which is awesome. Anybody want to learn a move? Nope. We're all good. But there we go. Finish off this gym battle. We can get ourselves the gym badge and actually the TM for this place too. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. I may proudly be the strongest member of this gym, but I was totally washed away. Almost 8,000 cash. The, the lucky, the luck incense already uh, pulled its uh, value already. Let's go. Give me that gym badge. I want to put it in that little pendant looking thing, that collecting thing. Oh, yes. Let's see what it is. What's it look like? Because the other one was a leaf. Oh, this is probably a water droplet. Yeah, like three little water droplets. And it fits perfectly in over here. I cannot wait to fill this whole thing. Get a nice little handshake. 
Now I can catch higher level Pokemon and all that. And the next gym is the Fire Gym. Who's going to dominate against that? Our Dreadnought. Let's go. What TM we get? Whirlpool. Perfect. We can actually give this to a Dreadnought. That would be a pretty solid move to actually give him. Beautiful. Beautiful. And what else are you going to get? The Water Uniform, which is nice. That's awesome. Collect all this stuff right here. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, subscribe to the channel. As in the next episode, we're going to start making our way to the next route and the next town over. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everyone.